Okay, so this is our setup for climate control. First, we're going to test the light sensor. As you can see, this tiny thing here is a light sensor. It turns the frequency into a digital signal. It has an AD converter uh, built in it. We'll take the signal from the sensor and take it to the microprocessor. We process the signal and we send the output based on the intensity of light. Basically, we have two levels of intensity. Uh, one is the lowest level, this, uh, there's a uh, medium level, and then the highest level. This is the LCD. As you can see, we have three variables, temperature, humidity, and light. First of all, we test light. So right now, the intensity of light in the room, it's fixed at uh, six. So it has no units because um, it's just a simple variable. So I'll try to block the sensor. And as you can see inside the box, we have three LEDs. So right now, the intensity is at highest. When we go to the medium intensity, the two LEDs will turn on. As you can see, two LEDs have turned on, and the light intensity has gone down to three. So if I make it more dark in the room, let's say completely cover the sensor, the light intensity will go down to zero, and all three LEDs will turn on. Now if I remove the light, remove the, this black thing from the sensor, the light intensity will increase, and all the LEDs have turned off. So our next process is controlling the temperature and humidity. As you can see, this is our house. And inside, we have mounted the temperature and humidity sensor. Now this sensor measures the temperature and humidity inside this plastic box. And the readings are sent back to the microprocessor. The microprocessor processes the readings and sends the output um, back to the control system, which is connected via a relays. So these are two relays. They're being controlled by the microprocessor, um, which outputs five volts. And these uh, relays, uh, the output of the relays are connected to two fans. So one fan is mounted on the box, which is used to increase the temperature inside the room. So basically, this takes all the air that's, um, that's in the room and puts it inside the box, basically increasing the temperature. The second fan we have is mounted on our cooling equipment. So the cooling equipment forces air from the room inside this metal box. This metal box is cooled down. So the, the warm air mixes with the cool, cooler box, and the, the cooler air goes through this pipe into the box. So right now, as you can see, the temperature and humidity readings on the LCD are 24 degrees, 24.1 degrees Celsius and 31.3% relative humidity. So that's the readings inside the box. So right now, I'm going to turn on the temperature circuit. So basically, the temperature is really high right now. We want to maintain the temperature inside the room to 19 degrees Celsius. So as you can see from the LCD, the temperature goes down right away. And you can see the humidity is going up because we're mixing cold air with, um, with wet air, which increases the humidity. So you can see the temperature is going down. This is very rapid. We started at 24 degrees Celsius, and we're going to go down to 19 degrees Celsius. Okay, so you can see right now the temperature has fallen to 20.2 degrees Celsius and it will go down to 19 degrees Celsius. So all the while it is also monitoring the humidity and the light at the same time. So right now, as you can see, the temperature fell below 19 degrees Celsius and the exhaust fan kicked in the warm, uh, warm air was being sent inside the box. So right now, our temperature is in the setting point range. So we're going to control the temperature inside the room using the two fans. So whenever the temperature falls below, uh, below, below the threshold point, the, exhaust uh, the warm fan will turn on. It will bump up the temperature. 
and when the temperature reaches the upper threshold, the cool fan will kick in, and basically cooling down the temperature. So this way we can control the temperature inside this box. So you can see the temperature is constant at 20 degrees Celsius. The room temperature is 24 degrees Celsius right now. So the temperature increased. So right now it is, it's at a constant value, so both the fans are off. So the temperature is going up now. If it reaches a threshold value, the cooling fan kicks in. So these are the readings from the laptop. As you can see, the first reading is for the temperature, the second is for the humidity, and the third one is for light. So if you go to the first one, SOT stands for the raw temperature reading, which is 6001 right now. The second reading is TC, which stands for temperature in Celsius, and TF for temperature in Fahrenheit. The last line is telling you the status of the fans, which fan is being turned on. So right now the cooling fan is working because it's trying to keep the value constant between 19.9 and 20.3 degrees Celsius. So the second reading of the humidity, temp uh, humidity readings, the first line is the raw value from the sensor, the second is the linear uh, relative humidity, and the third one is the true relative humidity. The last line is the light reading. As you can see, 13 is right now what's the intensity in the room, uh, in the room right now. And if you cover the sensor, it will go down to two and the lights will turn on.